Summertime storms and summertime humidity in our last day before the unofficial start to summer. It's meteorologist Joe Martucci here. Good to be with you. We do have the risk for severe weather from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. It's a cold front that brings some showers and thunderstorms across the area. Now, what I believe happens is this kind of comes in two rounds. Through about 11 a.m. or so, it's mainly in Ocean County. And then 11 a.m. to 1 p.m., it's for Atlantic, Cumberland, and Cape May counties. Now, lightning is a moderate risk with cloud to ground lightning in spots. High winds not ruled out, as well as some hail as we go through this time. Temperatures will be warm. We start out in the 60s, well above average, and we get to around 80 inland at 11 a.m., 70 at the coast. We go into the afternoon here, 68 in Surf City, 81 in Toms River. Sounds like late May to me with these temperatures, and we slide to around 70 degrees as we get towards 9.30 p.m. Now, our hair cast for your Thursday, curly hair with dew points in the mid to upper 60s. You'll be feeling that humidity out there as we go into the day today. Now, we do have a round of showers to come this evening from about 7 p.m. to midnight or so. Then we're pretty much dry. We go into Friday here, early clouds, maybe a shower to about 7 a.m. But by the time we get towards 10 o'clock and we'll have the unlocking of the beaches in Ocean City, let's say, and Atlantic City, we have a good amount of sunshine, and you got a beach day. In fact, Friday will be our best beach day of Memorial Day weekend. We'll have a good amount of sunshine, more temperatures. Friday night, as the shore fills on up for the summer season, we look to be pretty cloudy, but pretty mild as well. Saturday and Sunday are trending drier here. In fact, I think it's just an inland shower or storm Saturday afternoon for some of us. The beaches are dry. And we go into Sunday, and yeah, it's going to be pretty cloudy, but I think those thunderstorms Stay west of the Garden State Parkway. So if you do have a barbecue in Hamilton or Jackson, just keep that in mind. I wouldn't cancel your outdoor plans, but there will be some isolated showers and storms around during the PM hours. Doing it in Seaside Heights, Cape May, Point Pleasant, you're looking fine to me. And we go into our Monday here, Memorial Day itself. Probably the coolest day, definitely the cloudiest day. And there will be thunderstorms. It could bring severe weather. We will update you as we go on throughout the weekend. So to recap with our Memorial Day weekend, no washouts expected. Great news here. That is fantastic. Friday's the best beach, pool, and water day. No matter what you're doing on the water, Friday's the best day to do it. Severe weather does threaten on Monday. So let's take a look at our inland seven-day forecast, show you what's going on. 80s for Thursday, Friday, pair of sevens for Saturday and Sunday. Remember, most of these days will be dry. And then Monday, some, some strong storms probably late in the day here. I don't think it's a washout either. And then we go into Tuesday, comfortable, and we're staying about seasonable. Over at the shore, Friday, warmest day of the weekend here. Upper 60s for Saturday, Sunday. Good life weather. Maybe not the best day to lay out on the sand or hang out on the boat, but good life weather to be out and about. We go to Monday here again, thunderstorms during the day. I think those Memorial Day ceremonies will be okay. For more from me and our Lee weather team, find our Across the Sky podcast. New episodes come out every Monday wherever 